Hi, I'm Brad Carney, and this is Mural Arts Philadelphia's 2021 Summer Internship Program. We're very excited this summer for our interns. We have 12 of them. They're from all around our city. They're working with some of our most amazing muralists here in Philadelphia. They'll be working on cloth. They'll be working with community. They'll be working directly on the wall, learning the basics up to the most advanced levels of mural creation. We are so very proud to have them, and we are so excited for you to watch this video. I applied for the summer internship because I love painting personally and I wanted to do something with the community in Philly this summer rather than just like doing stuff for myself. So it's been really rewarding being out here. I love Philadelphia. I love that this is the mural capital of the world. I've always worked really big. I was an art student at Penn State and my degree is in painting and I did really large scale paintings that were basically like their own mo mobile murals and I wanted to keep getting bigger and bigger. So I thought what's the biggest thing you could do is probably a mural on top of the side of a building. The mural we're working on it has some very, very, very bright colors and being able to uh, just see it evolve and seeing this really nice shade of blue right next to this really nice shade of red. Like just the vibrancy of that and seeing that's just the best part so far. Community involvement honestly has been my favorite part. Um, having kids walk by and seeing what you're doing and, and asking how they can get involved or adults asking how they can get either their kids or themselves or people that they know like involved. I feel like in terms of murals that's really like the, the big payback of like being a part of the program. My favorite part has been getting the to watch the sheets get glued onto the wall and kind of see it go from the studio to real life on the street. The gradient part of the painting on the wall, I never knew how to do that with the two different colors, but once Brad showed me it, like it clicked instantly. I'm like, oh, so that's how you do it. And I was doing it wrong like back home when I did my murals, which is pretty funny. Why I like this uh, new art is because uh, it's community-based artwork and uh, it's very different because uh, when I work in my own work, I, I, I focus in my own ego, but when I'm doing a mural, it's actually for the community. I think that's the big difference. We're doing murals that are kind of reflecting on our situation now because those are things that really need to be spoken up loudly about and acknowledged. It's not just that you create works of art, but that you think about the world a little differently, which is refreshing and wonderful and needed. We, we tend to, in our society, we have traditional ways of approaching things, and then when that fails, we just do the same thing over and over again. And sometimes you actually need, a, you need an artist at the table, you need a creative person, you need someone to embrace creativity and innovation to crack the code. We did a bunch of workshops with kids where every kid got to do drawings around the theme of the mural. And the theme of the mural is once you learn to become fearless, you can do anything. And so some of those drawings got projected right into the mural and we're copying them exactly as the kids drew them. Whoever approaches us and asks questions are very supportive of the uh, mural that we're installing. Probably because some people recognize parts of people from the community. A lot of times you see yourself in murals around the city in a different way than you do if you go to the museum or go to galleries or things like that. And I feel like it's super validating for people to see themselves reflected in art. When I came to Philly, the first thing I really noticed was how bright and wonderful Philly is because of the murals. And it just like makes people feel a part of something, whether you're working with the murals or if your community is represented. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you to the interns. Thank you, Jane Golden, for your constant support of this program. Thank you, Susan Sherman, for your constant funding and support of this program through the Independence Foundation. And thank you to the Lynn Manco Scholarship for supporting our young art ed apprentices. Have a great summer, and we'll see you next year.